I think uh, the difference between TikTok hashtags and Instagram hashtags is that what I've seen with Instagram is more is more. You put a lot of uh, hashtags on the Instagram post and that's going to push it out a lot more. I mean, yeah, but I think nowadays, like even Instagram themselves are kind of the middle of the hashtags don't really do anything. Um, so just yes aesthetic. yes i no for that okay. um, they're just pretty they're just decorative <laughs> well anyway with uh tiktok less is more yeah. um about five is kind of going to be the number that you want to hear anymore and you start just getting a little bit convoluted because mm-hmm. basically the way it works is you think with more hashtags it's going to push it out to people who like say you're doing stuff about chocolate and you do hashtag chocolate and then you do hashtag milk chocolate and you think it's going to push out to all the people who like chocolate and all the people who like milk chocolate i'm going somewhere with this analogy but just (laughs) just stick with it but basically what it does is that it filters it down level by level Mm -hmm. so actually the more hashtags you put on it the more you're filtering to the audience it picks so you're getting more so you're getting more refined yeah so the best thing to do is have your the way that i always do it is have um two trending and two broad ones Mm -hmm. Um, because that's kind of the best way you're going to get around it um, to keep it as open and possi- uh, viewed by as many people as possible. Nice. Um, but yeah, it is one of those ones where keeping it small is the best way to go. You can even do um, TikTok, do sort of recommend a no hashtag strategy, which can work sometimes, um, not all the time. I think if you want to trial some stuff out, I'd say do a couple with no hashtags, do a couple with and just see what works for you. I think as well, like we see this with brands on on Instagram and other platforms too, is sometimes when you're in the early stages of growing an account, you need everything behind you to try and get an audience and try and grow that. So, you know, if you have managed to grow a really engaged audience, your account is in favor of the algorithm and you're doing a good job, you know, that may be an appropriate time for you to start testing a no hashtag strategy. Yeah. 